The West German Leopard 2K was a prototype main battle tank designed in the early 1970s, with some of the test vehicles being fitted with the smoothbore RH-120 cannon. This cannon offered a significant increase in performance over the ubiquitous 105mm L7, with the DM-13 armor-piercing fin stabilized discarding Sabo round being one of the first projectiles available. While DM-13 was one of the most effective APFSDS rounds of its time, the T-64A featured exceptionally thick turret armor. From the front, DM-13 would only have been able to penetrate the turret's weak spots, such as around the gun mantlet and in line with the optic port, as shown here. Sources state that the high hardness armor plates were overly brittle and that the welds on the backing plate could fail under large impacts. Despite this, the majority of the turret would have been impervious to most NATO tank rounds of the air. The Soviets also developed other turrets during this time, including one with quartz filler and another with ceramic balls, 